Luckstone is actually uh, the largest family-owned corporate rock quarry in the United States. And we've been in business for over 85 years. We happen to be in a very populated area just outside of Washington, D.C. This is a very uh, productive quarry. They move a lot of material and obviously uh, reduction in emissions is very important. We try to keep our fleet uh, fairly up to date and new, uh, not only to, for better production, but also it's, uh, it's better on the operators, plus we take a lot of pride in our equipment. So we started getting pretty interested in our carbon footprint and, uh, and, and actually the carbon footprint of our whole fleet. The 777, the engine was due to be repowered, so um, we had the option at that time of going with just a regular uh, older style engine or the upgrade, this uh, modification that we did perform. The power is a whole lot better on this machine. Um, it's, it's pretty obviously when you look at the smoke on the machines, you don't see smoke when they take off compared to the, uh, compared to the other machines that we have. So uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a tremendous benefit. It's a smaller engine than, than the older one, so it's smaller displacement. Uh, it's more efficient. Uh, it, it burns less fuel. We're seeing about 6% increase in fuel economy. Uh, it runs quieter for the operator and uh, it's a lot lower emissions. It doesn't smoke as much. Last year, we were averaging somewhere around 14.8 gallons per hour on the 777. And uh, when we repowered it, um, our, our average since repower, we're down around 14.07. So we're, you know, we're a net gain of, of uh, six tenths of a gallon per hour, which is significant. What we've noticed here recently, especially with going some of these more emissions friendly engines, we actually can stretch our oil oil changes out a little bit, and actually we do that. It's a lot better truck than what it was, and it, um, I think it'll last a long time. I've run uh, other brands, and uh, Caterpillar's got everybody beat. We could rebuild the machine, we could refit it. We had a, a brand new, pretty much, we feel like a brand new machine after it was rebuilt, so we got a second life out of it. So yeah, to me it was definitely cost effective. The project that we're doing, um, with you know, repowering the equipment is definitely in our vision going forward of how we can make that better so we don't have the black smoke coming out of the, you know, the trucks as they're going up and down and the, and the pollution that that causes. So absolutely, I say as we go forward, we're going to be looking at more things to be able to take care of that.